there Aries, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Astro Girl and we're looking at March 26 through April 1st. Social relationships are in the headlines this week because Venus has pulled triple duty by first conjuncting Uranus, the planet of change, in your sign, then changing signs, moving out of your sign and into Taurus, and lastly becoming the ruler of this week's full moon. This week's full moon is in Libra and it's the second full moon of the month. Remember that February didn't have a full moon, January had two, and April has two. Sorry, March has two. I'm getting ahead of myself. The kickoff is on Wednesday, March 28th, with the annual one-day Venus-Uranus conjunction. Because this meetup is an indication of unpredictable and possibly shocking events, this is not a good time to take a risk in love or with money. There's a temporary slowdown on Thursday, March 29, when the sun squares Saturn and places some obstacles in your path. Then on Saturday, March 31st, Venus moves into earthy Taurus, where she is completely at home. This upbeat shift means the next three weeks are a time for social relationships, self-esteem and finances to experience easy growth. Venus also presides over Libra and this planet's third job of the week is ruling the Libra full moon on Saturday, March 31st. Every full moon is a monthly marker of completion and the Libra full moon is the perfect time to cooperate with someone you dislike in order to get what you want and we've all had to do that, sleeping with the enemy so to say. This full moon leads into a different kind of Easter Sunday because this year Easter falls on April 1st, which is of course April Fool's Day. These, the last time these two holidays overlapped was in 1956 and the next time will be in 2029. Although Easter is traditionally a religious holiday, it's also a star-based holiday because it's celebrated on the first Sunday after the full moon following the spring equinox. Now just know that Venus moving into Taurus is moving into your second house of money and self-worth. So money is definitely going to be something that you're going to be thinking about and talking about over the next couple of weeks and something you've got to be very careful of because you could be a bit spendy over the next couple of weeks. And the full moon in Libra is in your relationship zone and full moons are all about completion. So if there's something you and your other half have been arguing about, it's time to put it to rest and it's time for you to stop arguing and agree to something, Aries. Thanks so much for tuning in. I appreciate it and I look forward to speaking to you again next week.